it's taco time and here's what I've got going on. I have some corn tortillas, I have some rotel, some pepper jack, plant-based cheese, some lettuce, and some unseasoned beans. These are the beans I made um, previously in the crock pot. They are not pinto beans. They are cranberry beans. They're absolutely delicious and we're going to season them for tacos right now. I'm going to mash these beans up a little bit. I like my beans kind of partially mashed, partially not, not mashed. Of course, I love refried beans, but they don't have to be completely uh, mashed. Of course, that's up to you. I'm going to get these a little mashed and we'll be right back to put in uh, the seasonings. All right, that's about the consistency I like. I'm going to go ahead and uh, sprinkle some onion powder on this. And I'm going to go ahead and sprinkle some garlic powder on this. And finally, some taco seasoning. And again, the amount is going to be up to you. Just start sprinkling it and taste it and see if it's what something you like. Mix it up. And then keep experimenting till you get a flavor you like. The beans are cold right now, but I'm going to warm them up in the microwave right before the tacos are done frying. So let's get started with that. I like to have the uh, oil on at about 400. This is an electric frying pan. And I let it get nice and hot. And then I put my tortillas right in there like that. I'm going to have four tonight. And just let them cook. I do not, um, I do not fold them. I just cook them flat and turn them over. Well, I've turned them over and they're kind of a light tan. You can do them as dark as you want. I like this particular uh, uh, shade. While these are cooking, I'm going to put my beans with cheese on top into the microwave for about two minutes. All right, so these have cooked about as much as they're going to cook. So I'm going to take them off right now and put them on a, uh, I have a board here where they're going to just drain for a few minutes. So let's get our tacos done, or tostadas, or whatever they are, open face like this. It's going to take my warmed up uh, beans with some cheese on it and put some on each uh, shell here, just like that. Just enough. And then spread it out. You can add beef or dairy cheese, whatever you want. This is just what I feel like eating tonight, of course. Now it's toppings time. I'm gonna to put on some uh, of this uh, taco sauce, Taco Bell taco sauce from um, Walmart. Even though I have the Rotel, it has a little bit of spice in it, still good. Let's have a little bit more. Some lettuce. And finally, some rotel. Usually I use um, fresh tomatoes, but I don't have any tonight. So rotel is great. You can find all sorts of stuff in your pantry that will take the place of stuff you're used to eating. And it's just as good. And there we are. So I'm going to sit down and have a great dinner right now. And I hope you're having a great dinner too. Thank you so much for watching.